don't stray from the path. A few moments later. Hello and welcome to my channel, D and Co Outdoors. There's a house up here. Let's go and investigate. Wow. I think somebody does. Or not, I don't know. Beautiful. Whoa, that is well beautiful. Guess it's the farmers. Landed in quite well with the scenery. Yeah. Super duper. Cooper trooper. <laughs> what a wacko. We've stopped for a bit of lunch and it started to sleet. <laughs> Typical. Oh. Go right. Getting some some goodies on, some warm goodies. Nice out here though. Quiet. Not surprised. Bloody sleety. It's finally lit. Hey! <laughs> Views, though. <laughs> Turn it this way. Holy goodness, look, a bit of sunshine poking through. <laughs> you can hear the grouse up here as well. They make that weird <laughs> noise. Well, that's probably a really bad um, mimic of it, but never mind. Hiding down there, fighting with his equipment, his action cameras, useless sometimes. Pay all that money and they've done the bloody work. Mind you, it is quite cool, but still, they're meant to work in the cold. Hopefully, that place is open, I'm gonna pop in. They do vegan cake in there, so for anybody who's like plant-based, uh, can definitely highly recommend. I think it's called Peak Tea Rooms. They would buy a tea room. Just go straight down there. Yeah, you get a nice slice of something and use their wonderful toilet but we're going to go down this way, cut down there and then you saw that Pete's over there filming, uh, change of plan, we were going to camp over that way somewhere, not sure where but over there somewhere 
but now we're heading in a different direction because this is what we like to do simple basic plan and then just change it yay change it to however you feel fantastic area though very nice hello uh, we are heading right down towards our camp spot so we're gonna head up here up this trail up to the top and then hopefully find somewhere to camp around there it's not windy at all actually the wind's gone at the moment don't know what it's gonna be like at the top it's not forecasted to be too windy so it should be quite cool uh, it is going to be quite cool, as in cold. I think um, the lowest temperature it's predicted to be is minus three, but that's with the uh, slight breeze, so the feels like temperature, which is pretty damn cold anyway. That's probably around one or two o'clock in the morning, but not too bad. I love, absolutely love this lone Christmas tree, which I've come up to. It's great. I'll bring you back to that in a moment. Peeps behind me, doing a bit of filming. There's, there's where we were going to camp over there. <laughs> it's following us. <laughs> it keeps laughing at us. The sun hasn't appeared even though it said it was going to. A little tiny bit of blue sky. Mr. Blue Skies. I do like the clouds though. Turtles. Look like turtles. Ninja teal! See that gate up there? That's where we've just come down from.
we're set up for the night. It's now morning, quite early. It was that cold last night, we uh, just got in those pits, battened down the hatches. Oh yeah, kept me nice and snug and warm, nice and toasty. Cold again this morning. That's cool. Made it to the trig last night in the dark. Not quite. We're just packing away now. <clears throat> packing away on this fine, very cold morning. Beautiful views all around. Once we're packed up, we will be off to off down that way, and then all the way across to there, and then follow the track over the mall and, and down into the valley. Nice little route, straightforward. A lot of downhill. Yesterday was all uphill. <laughs> all up today, all down. Very good. Beautiful views. It's very cold. One glove. One mitt. Across the moors. We are going across the moors. Stick to the path. Don't stray from the path. But this isn't the area that it was filmed in. I believe Moken Werewolf of London was filmed in Yorkshire, wasn't it? Possibly. Somewhere in Yorkshire. But yeah, Saddleworth Moor, I think, somewhere up there. Could be wrong though. Could be anywhere around here, couldn't it, when you think about it? Yeah, yeah, You've got yeah. the weird pub yeah. behind us. <laughs> yeah. Stick to the moors, stick to the path. Don't know what's out there. Nothing. Grouse making weird noises. That's enough to scare the living daylights out of you at night time. The grouse. The little red head. <laughs> I think it's mating season though. That's why there's so many about. Yeah. That time of year. Spring is in the air. Calm, no action. Too cold. It's come on, but it's a bit dodgy. So we're going to follow this down here. This is a bit of a dodgy bit. We're following the uh, the little stream, but very rocky. So got to be careful. Plenty of water, though. Yep. Plenty. Beautiful. That's the worst and gnarly bit done. It's uh, quite treacherous underfoot with all the loose rocks. But obviously made worse with massive backpacks. And now we're heading down there. But we're not going up that way. We're going to drop down. Because just down there is, is the crossroads. Um, which we go right at, not up the hill. We go down into the brook. So, almost there, almost back. Very nice, isn't it? Well, welcome to the end of the video. We are almost back at the car. It's just down past that farm. Uh, where's my point in there? 
just down past that farm and the cars are parked there waiting for us a nice little bridge area with the stream coming all the way down very nice can't remember what the brook's name is it's pretty cool Pete's taking some photos well we've come from up there nice stroll down last section and then back to the car I might even make myself a brew warm up a little bit because it is absolutely freezing today it is looks like the farmers trails up there beautiful area though beautiful well the shuttling's low up the top which was where we were going to go but we changed our minds and went that way <laughs> so anyway hopefully got a bit of decent footage and you can see a nice little route that we did did a little bit of filming last night but it was um, so cold I just had to get into my DOS bag around 7 I think it was in the end because it was freezing could not feel my handies anyway hopefully I will see you soon Enjoy the views. See you later. Bye.